Peter Jones, chairman of Asset Manager London Group, and his wife, ex-story frontbencher Jack Wheelate, 70, were victims of a scam recently when their car broke down in Cape Town. After contacting the rental firm, a recovery truck duly appeared and towed away the vehicle. It later transpired that the Jones rescuers were, in fact, opportunistic passers-by, to whom they then had to pay a 6,000 rand, 350 pounds, bung to get the car back. Jones whimpers, we were left feeling right idiots. Shares are at a five year low, there's uncertainty over Premiership football rights plus a gaping pounds 13 billion hole in its pension fund. Might Gav's new chairman, Jan Duplessis, soon feel it is time for change at the top. If so, I'm advised that perky ex of Penrich boss, Liv Garfield, 42, now roosting at Severin Trent, would be well worth the flutter. Such a pity that a half dozen gorgeous lovelies dining at the next door table didn't offer a perch to the suave bachelor. He showed up for an interview with CNBC yesterday dressed as though he'd come straight from a weekend at the Burning Man Music Festival wearing a pink neon t-shirt and hoodie, his wrist festooned with leather bracelets. He must also be the only Nasdaq boss who has a vast, gangster rapper-style medallion dangling from his neck. Business Week offers helpful suggestions to bankers looking to spend their recent bonuses, including a Grubel 4 Sea Earth Watch, £470,000, a diving trip to the wreck of the Titanic, £75,000, and a Kalamazoo wood fire grill, £18,000. A steel, readers are advised.